Your timing is perfect because look, look who's making her way down. Oh, oh. Hey, that was pretty graceful. Well done. I've seen leopard cubs this size go tumbling out of trees, but the female cub managed to make that descent look almost like she's mastered the art of tree climbing. She nearly dropped the carcass out of the tree, just by the way. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. A little bit of affection there between mom and daughter. Quickly clean, her, clean away all of that dacre that I'm sure she's got everywhere. Krula making sure that her cubs stay clean. <laughs> Even when they resist. She was lying on the carcass earlier, so Karula doing a fantastic job of sorting her out. Cleaning paws away. No, Mom. Mom, I don't want a bath. I'm done now. <laughs> I want to fight. I want to play fight. Oh, I'm so glad that we've got to see this. I'll just bear with me one second. Um, Taxon is wanting to come and join us. Oh, got you, Mum. <laughs> I'm Kathy in Tennessee. We're watching this little female batter Mum about and resist her attempts at a bath an attempt to make them into playtime, you're wondering who becomes or which becomes independent first, a female or a male. Interestingly enough, it's the female cubs that tend to become independent faster. They just generally show more independence than the male, even if they're a little bit shyer at first. They're usually the ones that start play hunting first. She was trying to move the carcass around earlier, and at around a year and a half, they'll start to move off on their own. Male cubs, on the other hand, actually tend to be mommy's boys. And they stick around for a little bit longer, every now and again moving off on their own and then coming back. And they can stay with their mom right up until two years old and even revisit her a couple of times in their initial first steps towards independence. Oh, somebody's getting a really thorough bath from mom. George could not be... Oh, no, I'm doing it again. I'm, I'm in that habit now. James has done a, a terrible thing. <laughs> Michelle, you want to know who will give the cubs their official names. Well, at this point, I mean, I'm going to have a habit that is going to be incredibly difficult to break. But the official naming will be done at a rangers meeting where every interested party... Hello, gorgeous. <laughs> Sorry, Michelle. Yer, cub pile. <laughs> 